what's going on guys, it's Brian with Super Men's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com and in this video I'm going to give you my weekly picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday, January 23rd, 2019. So this video is sponsored by my Patreon members, totally appreciate their support, they help me make this happen. But enough talky talk talk, let's get into the video. We kick the week off with Aquaman number 44. Picking up from the last issue, the one-time Sea King becomes obsessed with finding the mysterious red-headed woman from his vision. There's a regular Robson Rocca cover. There's also a regular priced variant by Raphael Albuquerque. I like the Albuquerque cover on this one. Batman number 63. Batman enlists the help of John Constantine, but after the events of the Witching Hour, is Constantine in any condition to help the Dark Knight detective? We have a regular cover. There's also a regular price variant by Tony S. Daniel. I like the regular cover for this issue. Freedom Fighters number two. The Freedom Fighters go public in a present day Nazi America. Justice League number 16. Martian Manhunter, Green Lantern, and Hawkgirl go out to find why would the Guardians of the Universe hide top secret intel deep in the bowels of a secret vault on Thanagar Prime. We have a regular Jim Chung cover. There's also a regular price variant by Will Conrad. Naomi number one. When a fight between Superman and Mongol crashes into a small northwestern town, Naomi begins a quest to uncover the last time a super-powered person visited her home and how that might tie into her own origins and adoption. We have a regular cover by Jamal Campbell. There's also a regular priced variant by Manuela Lupacino. Teen Titans number 26. In this issue, Teen Titans plot to break into the Batcave. There's a regular cover by Giuseppe Comancoli. There's also a gorgeous regular price variant by Alex Garner. I'm picking up the Garner. Road of the Dead Highway to Hell number three. Harriet has a possible cure for the zombie plague, but how many of her friends have to die to help her find out if she can save the world? There's three different covers for it. There's a regular Santa Perez cover. There's a regular price Drew Moss variant. There's also an incentive Santa Perez black and white variant. Monstrous returns from its hiatus in Monstrous number 19. As Mike and Corvin search for Kippa through a warped and lethal land, Kippa herself will face her own terrible monsters. Oliver number one. This takes Charles Dickens' classic and reimagines a famous orphan as a post-apocalyptic superhero fighting to liberate war-ravaged England. There's a regular Derek Robertson cover. There's also a regular priced variant. Avengers number 13, this is another flashback of the prehistoric Earth's mightiest heroes and we meet the primordial woman who was the first to harness the power of the heart of the dragon Shao Lao becoming the very first Iron Fist. We have a gorgeous regular cover by Steve Epting, there's a regular priced Guardians of the Galaxy variant by Patrick Zercher, and a regular priced Conan vs Marvel Villains variant by Mike McCone. Crypt of Shadows one shot for Marvel's 80th anniversary they have gone into the vault to bring back some classic titles from the Marvel of yesteryear. Something terrifying is broken free and crawled forth from one of the most terrifying corners of Marveldom, the Crypt of Shadows. There's going to be a regular cover by Kyle Hotz, there's a regular price variant by John Tyler Christopher, and a Young Guns Pepe Larraz regular price variant as well. Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man number two. This is going to have a regular cover by Andrew C. Robinson. There's also a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Brian Hitch. I like the incentive variant, but I don't know if I want to pay $20, $25 for it. Guardians of the Galaxy number one. This introduces an all new Guardians team. It's got 12 different covers for it. There's a regular David Marquez cover, regular price Jeff Shaw wraparound variant, regular price Ron Lim Guardians of the Galaxy variant, regular price Blank variant, Regular price Bernie Wrightson Hidden Gym variant, regular price Scotty Young Baby variant, regular price Mike Diodato Jr. Party variant, 1 in 10 incentive Steve Scrochi variant, 1 in 25 Jarrell Peril variant, 1 in 50 Asad Ribic variant, and an, and an incentive David Marquez Premier variant, as well as an incentive Mike Diodato Jr. Party Sketch variant. Whew, that's a lot of covers. Immortal Hulk number 12. This is part one to Hulk in Hell. And just to keep it short, everyone is in Hell to include Immortal Hulk. There's three different covers. There's a regular Alex Ross cover, regular price Guardians of the Galaxy variant by Jeff Shaw, and a regular price Conan vs. Marvel Villains variant by Will Sliney. Man Without Fear number four. This issue focuses on how Kingpin deals with Daredevil being gone. There's three different covers. There's a regular Kyle Hotz cover, Regular price connecting variant by Giuseppe Comancoli and a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Declan Shelby. Superior Spider-Man number 2. And no, that's not Darkseid on the cover. The 
it's Terax, the cosmic level foe outpowers Otto Octavius, the superior Spider-Man by a factor of 10. This is going to have three different covers for it. There's a regular Travis Charis cover, regular Price Gardens of the Galaxy variant by Mike McCone, and a 1 in 25 incentive variant by Mike Hawthorne. War is Hell one shot again to celebrate Marvel's 80th anniversary. They're bringing back older titles, and this is going to have two tales about war. It's going to have three different covers for it. There's a regular cover by Dan Panosian. There's a regular price variant by Greg Land. There's also a regular price Young Guns variant by Marco Cicchetto. I love the Cicchetto. Gorgeous cover. Love it so much. In fact, that's going to be my pick of the week. I have a number five. This comes from Ahoy Comics. It's the season finale. Archangel Gabriel fights to rescue David from heaven, but will have to get through a cruel and powerful St. Peter. Blossom 666 number one. This is from Archie Comics, written by Cullen Bunn, so you know it's gotta be decent horror. Cheryl and Jason Blossom are a pair of seemingly normal kids in Riverdale. They're wealthy, popular, and likable, but they also harbor a deep, dark secret one of the Blossom Twins is the Antichrist. This is going to have five different covers. This is a regular cover, regular price Joe Eisma variant, regular price Francesca Francavilla variant, regular priced Robert Hack variant, and a regular priced Vic Malhotra variant. Die Kitty Die Heaven and Hell number four. Kitty Ravencraft has been killed. Now everybody's favorite redheaded witch has received her final mission from God herself, find her own killer. We have a regular cover by Dan Parent. It's a regular price variant by Fernando Ruiz. That's an awesome Scooby-Doo homage cover. So there you have it, guys. Those are my picks for new comics that are coming out Wednesday, January 23rd. If there's a comic that I missed, comment down below. Let me know what books I should be picking up, which books I should be adding to this video, or if it's just a title that you enjoy. Now, if you enjoy watching this video, please make sure you click that thumbs up button for me. And if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe and bell notification so you'll be notified of future videos. This is Brown with Superman's Comics in collaboration with comicbookinvest.com, and I'll see you guys next week.